or different steering options at Vantage Ireland. We started with manual guidance systems. Um, we have our Easy Pilot Pro, which is fitting an electric steering wheel to replace the steering wheel on the tractor with electric motor to steer the tractor. Or we can we can wire into can guidance systems. So on a case, New Holland, Massey Ferguson, Valtra, Fint, uh, John Deere, we can actually break into the can on the tractor and uh, that can allow us to control the steering that's already on the tractor. So I'll just take you around this T7 190 New Holland and show you how we know this tractor is steer ready um, and the few easy checks to check on your tractor no matter what make or model it is. They'll all probably have a steering sensor on the front axle, the orbital unit will have a, a plug on it to control the hydraulics and it'll more than likely have a controller in the cab or a cable running up to the roof. So um, we'll just walk around this tractor and look at them few bits and you can look at that for your own tractor, be it Case New Holland or, or, or anything else. Um, So on the front axle of this tractor we've got a small little wire running down here into the axle and that's for the steering sensor on the axle. So this little wire in here, um, we can't actually see the sensor but that, that wire following along here is in for the steering sensor on the axle. Um, people might get confused, they might see the, the small brake lines for, the fr for front brakes or they might see grease pipes. There's a sensor there for the front axle suspension but um, it is this wire going into the axle for a steering sensor. So um, if it's another make or model, you'll have a wire there for a steering sensor somewhere on the front axle. Um, then when we go around and pop the bonnet, um, so when we pop the bonnet and we look in at the orbital unit on the tractor, we can see here we've got sort of a control block with with a plug on the end of it and that's how we know if you had just an orbital unit just a round circular orbital unit with um, um, just just your pipes on it just your hydraulic hoses you would know but you can see here we've got a pipe with a cable coming off it here um, and that's that's how we know that that orbital unit is controlling the steering through through the can so that's another check when we come up into the cab then and fold down the passenger seat this tool tray here, the tool tray is higher, it's about four or six inches higher than the passenger seat. So there is a controller under here. So on the case of New Holland tractors 2018 plus, it's a good thing to check. Um, if it's not steer ready, that cover will be level with the passenger seat because there won't be a controller under there. But uh, with the steer ready tractors, that's risen up slightly to allow for the controller under here. So that's another thing to check. If your tool tray is higher, then your tractor is more than likely steer ready. But we can confirm it all after anyway. Um, again, if we look here on the tractor, um, on the controller here on the tractor, we can see we've got the autopilot switch to engage your auto steer. Um, now, it is possible a tractor could have this switch on it and not be steer ready. But um, it's, a, it's a good indication that there is steering already in the tractor from factory.